continuation of the video I did last time before I cleaned this bike up. It's looking pretty good. The chrome looks decent. Still has some pitting in it. But it's a <coughs> 43 year old bike. It's a 43 year old bike, so you would expect that. At least I do. <clears throat> so, a couple things I did since the last time I cleaned it up. Um, the chrome cleaned up decent. I didn't do too much craziness with the engine. Um, I taped the seat here. And um, last time I was talking about the carbs, I cleaned them out. I had to take them off again. <clears throat> I thought I could take the bowls off and do that. It's not a good idea. So if you have one of these, just take the carbs off again and redo them. If you have to change something or whatever, it's a, it's a hassle. But <clears throat> trying to get those bolts out of there, and uh, especially the center ones, uh, not a good idea. I thought it was a good idea, but yeah, don't do that. So anyways, I took the tank off. Tank is pretty, actually was pretty clean, but I did take the petcock out and there was some sludge in there, but it was on the, uh, <clears throat> there's a screen in there and it was on the other side of the screen. But I did notice that <clears throat> when I took these carburetors apart the first time, uh, where the inlet is, for the um, for where the uh, gas goes in, I didn't really pay attention to that as much as I should, and there was some sludge in there, and uh, I think that made it run funny. I also changed the spark plugs. I had four NGK spark plugs that I uh, replaced <coughs> from the original ones that were in there, and um, like a day later. It was running funny and this cylinder wasn't getting hot and it, the spark plug died. It was a brand new spark plug, NGK, and uh, no good spark plug. So I replaced that and it, now it's running decent. I took it for a couple of <coughs> runs with it and it rides good and shifts good and everything. These things are they are pretty powerful for a 550 and... Uh, you know, they I definitely a uh, pretty well ba balanced bike. It's got 50 horsepower. So it's pretty good for for the year. It's pretty smooth too with the four cylinder, um, and it sounds pretty good with that pipe. So. <clears throat> Thought I'd make another video of it. Um, probably going to be selling it. Some guy's supposed to be coming to look at it on Wednesday. So, yeah. <clears throat> Just give you a once over. <clears throat> Still got that patina there. And I see a lot of, I've been doing some research, this green color from fading, it happens a lot on these when they're original paint. But, yeah, everything works. <clears throat> I like the size of the bike. Uh, it's not too big, because a lot of these, the cruiser bikes, when they made the cruiser bikes, they make them excessively long, it seems like. So... This is like a compact uh, bike with pretty good horsepower. So. There it is, CB550. Thanks for watching.